Ivan, and I even uh, welcome the Dean of the University of Casablanca, and we just want to say. The PARSCO is dedicated to improve the research on the Arabic woman all over the world. It's only a symbol that we think about personalized medicine to introduce so-called tailored treatments and to improve even the networking activities from the different generations, from medical students to the medical staff to the leading physicians and researchers in the Arabic world. And it's a clear objective that the Arabic people play the key role. We are only supporting them. The most important thing is that the countries make their own strategies, their own way, and we want to share our mistakes. We did several years, 15 years ago. And that's the only reason. So without the Arabic and the Moroccan institutions, it's impossible. That's the reason why we in Morocco, we are working so close with the Lala Salma Foundation. Because they are dedicated since several years, they make a wonderful job. But we want to work with them, because to avoid redundancy, but even to help them our experience and even to learn from their experiences. This is really a great opportunity for both the Arabic world and the Western world. Um, this meeting is an initiative of the Pan-Arabian Research Society of Gynecological Oncology and the uh, Gynecological Cancer Intergroup. And the objectives of this meeting is to bring together all of the Arabic countries with experts in the fields from the Western countries, the United States, Canada and the European countries to discuss issues on the care of women with gynecological cancers um, and come up with research initiatives to drive the care and improve the care of women with gynecological cancers. This kind of events will be beneficial for the promotion of health in general and the rights of women in the countries participating in these events today concerning the health of women more specially with regards to cancer screening. It is a very important part informed by information campaigns and also by allowing many women access to health care and then to early detection and screening. Therefore, it will reduce mortality rates and diseases. This will help again these women finding an adequate place in the socio-economic life and therefore it will enhance human development and consequently the development of concerned countries. It is a chain and a certain goal which we want to achieve and the conference obviously to accomplish it. There are very very good doctors in the south and uh, we need all the knowledge to improve the results of the treatment of uh, gynecological cancer. So we need our colleagues from the south and second uh, the best way to improve results is to participate in clinical trials. So what we can offer is an educational program to help to show them the benefits to work together, to work as a team. Because sometimes in some countries there is a lack of habit to work together. So I think that the most important is collaboration. And this is the message we are giving. So after that, what South can bring for the development of uh, new treatments to participate in clinical trials to offer the patients high technology as, as the trials are and for the north to the south working together we're going to reach better results sooner. We as physicians of Arab descendants we really feel the connection and the obligation that we help in every way we can to get us together with our colleagues in the Arab world who are still practicing in the Arab world, share with them what we have seen and what we have discovered in the Western countries, whether it's in Europe, United States, Australia. Listen to what they have seen here because they have a lot to offer. Our colleagues who are in the Arab world have a lot to offer. What we can share with them is what are the advanced processes that might have been set 
in the US or in Europe and they can that they can apply here or can you or they, that they can use here so this is really more of an exchange of information we might have sometimes access to more resources processes uh, infrastructure that exists in the Arab world that we can share but most importantly is to be able to talk together and discuss how to promote and improve care I'm totally proud because it's always difficult to create something new and new networks. And the most important thing was not the presentation from the experts. It was the dialogues, it was the type of question, or was the respect of each other, and to understand that prevention is, is as important as treatment optimization and women empowerment. So it's wonderful. And we will now go further, because at the end of the day, it's not the dialogue, it's the implication. That's the reason why I titled the Woman Marrakesh Cancer Days. What we want to reintroduce every two years with implication, with projects, with task forces, for instance, to sh make um, a database together, for instance, to establish a gynecologic cancer tumor bank, for all Arabic and African countries in Morocco. And to make partnerships like we have with a charity Berlin with the Hassan II Second University to make partnerships from Center of Excellence with Center of Excellence, with mentoring concepts, with preceptorships, with interactive exchange programs. So we are on the clear program and I am so happy that we can start in a so, so high level.